about the new Google Plus uh, local pages which are replacing the Google Places listings. Um, so what I've done is, at the time that I was writing it, I believed that it was only happening in America at the moment and it'll uh, gradually spread around, but um, surprise, surprise, I found something out today as well. So, <clears throat> what I did originally, I went into dentists in Washington DC and to see what we could, what we can find and um, what we have. Just a minute, this, it seems to stick when I'm making videos. What we have is uh, three organic listings above here and then we have the Google local um, <clears throat> or the, should I say the Google plus local pages here and you see that already well there's only one here this one soft touch dentist has a score of 23 out of 30 which is pretty good but he's got 53 reviews so let's have a look at the way the page is presented just have to wait a little time and there we are we're inside the listing now and there's an option to put photos on you can put more photos on or less let's just click photos and see if he's got any more there no he hasn't um, but he could have and that would improve his listing even better but he is number one for that particular term and we'll see if I come down here a little there's 48 reviews and most of them give him a three which is quite high uh, there's one letting him nothing at all, uh, but never mind. And you see, when you come in here, it'll say write a review. And something I found a moment uh, ago is <coughs> overall views, and it gives you a scoring guide here. So if we click, we'll find that 26 to 30 is extraordinary to perfection, 21 to 25, very good to excellent. 16 to 20, good to very good. 11 to 15, fair to good. Not, not to 10, poor to fair. And the individual scores are placed by the person making the review is 0 for poor to fair, 1 for good, 2 for very good, and 3 for excellent. So that's the way that works. All right. <clears throat> well, what I did then... I was going to show you how dentists in London uh, come up different uh, than dentists in Washington, but they don't. Surprise, surprise, they're already here. Um, I typed in Dentist London and here they are. Uh, there's one here that's got a score of 21, Pickering Dental uh, Surgeries, but it doesn't look like anybody else has. But this is all going to change rather rapidly as, as uh, this thing is happening. So it's going to be more important to get in there, get your listing claimed, and start getting people to review for you. Uh, Pickering Dental Surgery, here we are. We've got an overall score of 21. Again, if we go to the scoring guide, you'll see that it's very good to excellent, which is a, a good score. So, the next question I have to ask you is, if I go back, these are his reviews. But if I go back um, to the, the listings, Next thing I'm going to ask you is, if you were going to choose a dentist and you lived in London, which one would you use? That's got four reviews, eight reviews, seven reviews, a Google Plus page, seven reviews. I think you'd tend to go for that one, wouldn't you? Because it has got a pretty good, pretty good score. Anyway, I thought, well, that's that's in London. I bet it, nothing's happened in Tenerife. I can't believe. Um, that this has already happened in Tenerife because we're, we're way, way behind over here, you know. So I typed in Dentist Tenerife and again we've got um, some organic results including a video of my own here, Wolfie Worldwide, I'll just show you that. That's my YouTube username and that's because I've been targeting uh, dentists over here and so I made a video about it, called it Dentist Tenerife Put it in YouTube and there it is on page one uh, of the results. The Google listings, <coughs> uh, where are we? We've got nobody here with any prizes or any scores, but we have got the same sort of results. I'll just click on the Google page there and you see that it's already changed over here. Now these listings were made before we made these changes, so it doesn't affect the way that you uh, list your business. Um, so, 
really the advice I've given in my articles on on uh, on the first page of Google are, are still correct. Uh, anyway, let's have a look at uh, then car rental car rental Tenerife. I had had a little look at that as well, and what I found here we used to get seven come up. We used to get seven results, but apparently here now they're only giving the ones that have um, that have got a reasonable listing by the look of it, a reasonable website because the website works together with the listing. There's a rent a car, and let's scream down here a little. Ah, drives me crazy when I'm making these uh, videos because when the, uh, it's called it doesn't move. See there, right to score, no score yet. And again, we've got the score scoring guide. Um, I hope you found that interesting. If you did, um, click the link um, below the video that says uh, thank you very much, uh, I like this. And when you read my article, please click the uh, plus one button because it all helps. The more plus ones we get, it all helps to improve my own rankings. If you like the video, click the subscribe button above and uh, YouTube will send you new videos as I make them. Thank you for taking the time to watch this uh, video. Thank you.